Hey guys, what's going on? I've been working hard lately and I've got some really, really exciting news. I just opened my digital online store. I've got my wallpaper packs in there. I've got a free Lightroom preset called Juice that you guys should all go and download. It's completely free. I use the preset all the time. Then I've got my Lightroom version one presets that I came out with two years ago on there. And then my Lightroom presets volume two that came out last year is also on there. But what's really exciting or what I'm personally the most excited for is my Creative Vibes Lightroom presets that's dropping right now. The link will be in the description down below if you wanna grab any of the above items. I truly appreciate it. Every single purchase really does help my channel out and it helps me out. It allows me to continue to create some awesome content, which hopefully I'm doing. But if you're unfamiliar with how to install Lightroom presets, I'm gonna walk you through that right now. Once you make your purchase, I'll also have a PDF file with written instructions on how to install them. But for all of you that wanna see how to do it, this is for you. Once you download your files, it'll come as a zipped folder. Unzip it and then your Lightroom presets are there. Make sure you save it to your external hard drive or just anywhere safe. From there, we're gonna jump on my computer and I'm gonna show you what to do. Okay guys, so after you make your purchase, you get your zip file, which is right here. Double click it to unzip it. And now you will have your folder with all of your presets. Now what you wanna do is launch Adobe Lightroom. Once you have Lightroom open, you will just click this plus button next to presets, import presets, and then just choose the folder that you unzip and click import. I've already got it imported, so I'm not going to do it again, but let's just run through what you get. This is my black and white. This is butter, chill, clear skies, mood, oak, pop, stone, weekend, and work. I think pop looks pretty good on this one. Chill looks pretty pretty good. They actually all look pretty good, but let's go to a different scene and see what we get. Again, black and white, butter, chill, clear skies. As you can see, they all work, but sometimes it may not be to your liking. All you really have to do is adjust either your temperature, which I shot this at 5600. I'm going to leave that there, but adjust that, adjust your tint to get it more to your liking. You can always adjust your exposure. That looks pretty good there. So it's fully customizable. You can still adjust everything. If you don't like the way it looks with the one click, go ahead and just adjust it. But they all do work pretty well with just a click. Let's try clear skies on this one since it is of the sky. Pretty good. I think I like that. Chill might be one of my favorite ones that I have actually. We'll just run through a couple more really quick just to show you. Definitely Chill is one of my favorite ones that I've created. I do use it all the time. But again, like my wallpaper pack, I think I've got a little bit of something for everyone and you can always tweak it. Like these pictures don't look bad as they are, but add the preset on and bam. Everything just pops. If you're using Lightroom Mobile, it's pretty simple to install it that way. The easiest way would be to go to the online Lightroom. Install it the same way as I just showed you in Lightroom Classic, and it should automatically sync to your mobile device as long as you're logged in with the same Adobe ID. And that's it, it's pretty easy. Make sure you tag me on Instagram at amysung so I can check out all of your work. Thanks so much guys, I'll talk to you soon.